post-purchase upsell Shopify apps. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you some apps that will help you on the process of the post-purchasing, which is going to be here increasing the uh, sales of yours after the purchase. For example, you can go ahead and uh, put an upsell for the add-ons or add uh, some complementary or supplementary products that are going to fit with the product that uh, the customers has uh, bought already and etc. So it is very easy and very simple. Follow up the tutorial and you are going to learn more about the app sales apps. So the first thing that you need to do is to head over to Shopify.com, sign in for an account within the platform and create your own store. So after you have set up the account, you're going to see here the admin dashboard. Do not forget to add the products first. Here, first thing first, you need to add products. You need to set up the shipping rates and the shipping profiles. Also, you need to validate your payment methods. So you're going to click on add product. I'm going to add here a product for the sake of the video. So we need to do that. For example, you're going to add a shoe or sport or the shoe. For example, I'm going to add uh, this description. I'm going to upload here a picture like this one. And for the price of it, for example, we are going to put here a price like this. For the quantity, I'm going to put here an inventory and then we are going to track the quantity of, for example, like that. The variance, I'm going to add uh, the shoe size, for example. Here we are going to add these. For example, seven, seven half, here are tens, click on done. Then you are going to modify the uh, simply or the uh, price and also the quantity of it. So I'm going to copy and paste here. Uh, 999 right there, copy, paste it here, paste it there for all of the variants. So I'm going basically here to click on save. Here I have added everything. So as you can see, now we have added successfully our product. We are going to click on home. Then we are going to click on at the search bar at the top. So we are going to type in upsell. I'm going to search for the keyword on the Shopify app store and we are going to see a variety of apps. I'm going to let you see here the top uh, apps that I have used to use and here we have some so you can go ahead and use the upsell and cross sell by uh, sell easy uh, which is uh, this is a very well known app for upsells I'm going to let you see that uh, also we have the uh, after sell uh, post purchase upsell this one too here we have also release it COD form and app sales. This is also very well known for the Shopify store. And you have some, uh, the, for example, uh, the uh, free shipping upsell, uh, the essential here. We have one click upsell also for, from Zipify, OCU, and etc. You can go ahead and add all of these uh, to your store or one of the uh, apps. You can go ahead and alternate the test for each one of the apps. So in our case, we have this one, uh, the log based developer or development uh, right there uh, is very, very well known for their uh, quality of the uh, the apps that they have made also the fluidity and also the uh, built or optimized for Shopify stores apps. I, here we have also the after sale post purchase upsell from after sale by rocked uh, here we have also from released this one and etc so you are going to choose one of the apps i'm going to obviously work with this one you can go ahead and download whatever you want from here i'm going to install this uh, for the installation all the apps are the same you're going to click on install then you are going to have uh, right there the uh, admin page to release the permission for the app to be installed into your uh, right there dashboard. So we are going to click on install here. Wait some few, uh, some few seconds. 
right there and then we are going to see the app as you can see i'm going to pin it to our navigation here this is the first app that we have so we are going to see the menu of it and how we can start the uh, here so this is the free trial i'm going to set up the free trial uh, so I need a debit card or a credit card to make this happen. So I will add right there the plan. So after you have selected the plan or the uh, trial, you are going to begin here the first thing, which is going to be enable the uh, sale easy. I'm going to head over the theme editor. So we are going to enable the embedded app. We're going to get here the theme editor to the embedded app then we are going to enable that after that you are going to save it so we are going to click on save and from there we are going to get some widgets after that here we have the uh, key to the uh, sell easy key i'm going to copy this so you need that i am going to go to the theme editor we're going to copy and paste this specific button or this specific key we're going to head over again here we're going to click on it sales key boom we have added the key i think that everything is activated i'm going to close that it will uh, see if it is uh, enabled and it is now we are going to add uh, the offer and from here we are going to see the widgets we're going to see here the frequently bought together we have the product add-ons the cart add-ons which is going to be here a pop-up which is going to be here a very very high effective way to make some add-ons uh, bought by the clients here are the cart upsell and downsell as you can see they are going to display upsell and downsell offer based on customer accepting or declining the offer post purchase upsell which is right there for today's video thank you page add-ons and volume discount and etc so we are going to create a post purchase upsell like the title of this video of today so we are going to activate here the uh, shopify checkout we are going to click on enable now so we are going to see here what do are, are we going to do scroll down to post purchase page section shoes upsell right there check out scroll down so i'm going to scroll down here a little bit until we see here the post purchase page i'm going to make it as a sale easy this boom now everything is set now we are going to put a name for the offer for example jack's offer boom they trigger a specific product or all the products for example to select offer products you're going to set it as automatic for example a port tissue or to show free at least enable discount you can go ahead and add a discount for example as a percentage of 10 percent and here we are going to set up the offer priority for example to seven then we are going to click on save here you can also go ahead and uh, customize the widget i'm going to let you see here, here how we can customize the widget will not see that but i'm going to view the customizer Normally, it will open up here the store uh, or the admin page again, but in the customization section. So we are going to uh, be able to uh, customize this widget. You can disable the first uh, purchase uh, upsell, uh, upsell widget, and it's not necessary for here. You can see that everything here is going to be based on the countdown timer only. So we can go ahead and put up here a 10 minute countdown timer. I'm going to click on save, boom. Now we are going to head all back. You can see that we can customize the budget by uh, on any one of these. And here we have it. So that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and I'll see you soon on the next one.